Mark Wahlberg, Zoe Dashanel, John Leguizamo, these people have good careers. Don't they know that M. Night Shyamalan's movies suck? You're watching Review. There appears to be an event happening. Homeland Security and the CDC has reported attacks. Boston, Philadelphia, Maryland. White House officials claim the CIA has a defense against chemical weapons. I don't understand what you're saying. She says everyone's dead outside. What's going on? We lost contact. With whom? Everyone. The Happening. Poor M. Night Shyamalan. He loves to cry wolf in his movies, but after his last film, The Lady in Water, failed both financially and critically, the studios have decided to stop listening. But they'll always love you at home. So Indian-born Shyamalan went to Bollywood and got financing for his latest film, The Happening. This is his first R-rated film, and it tells the quasi-environmental story of a mysterious pollen that begins killing off mankind. Mark Wahlberg stars as a science teacher, and John Leguizamo plays his best friend, a math teacher, which is totally unrealistic. None of my teachers were ever that cool. What movie did you just see? The Happening. How was it? Horrible. It was very good. It was, it was suspenseful, and there were some moments where you're sitting on the edge of your seat, but I would say overall it was a little bit disappointing. The movie was about people killing themselves. After watching the movie, I want to kill myself. Oh, wow. Strong words. Just went nowhere. Uh, Storyline was stupid. Acting was just miserable. Uh, all, all across the board, horrible. You were genuinely scared. I was, I was frightened at, at, at when that wind came up, that was kind of like the, the villain of the piece, was the wind. So are you big at an M. Night Shyamalan fan? Is that why I you... am, actually. Sadly, I, I am. Well, why do you say I sadly? Say sadly because most people don't seem to like his movies. Was Mark Wahlberg good? Was he redeeming at all? He was good, but honestly, for this type of movie, we could have used him somewhere else. Well, Mark Wahlberg, I mean, he's okay to look at, right? I mean, whatever, but the rest of it, the rest of the people just sort of just die already. It was just, you waited for them to die. It was, okay, it's not dying, you're not dying quickly enough. And oh, then, no. but yeah, it was just horrible. I think they should have got some college students instead to do it for free, some interns. I think it would be much better. I think he's trying to be scary, and I think he's also trying to make a statement, perhaps, about our environment and the way we're treating the globe. What? For that. I think the central theme of the movie is important and that you sh sh should definitely see it. <laughs> Will you see another M. Night Shyamalan film? No, probably not. A lot of people come out of this film saying they're not going to see another uh, M. Night Shyamalan film. How do you feel? No, no. I saw The Village and I saw Lady in the Water and although I was disappointed, I admire him as a filmmaker. And even though he's not giving me the same thrills that he gave me with The Sixth Sense and Unbreakable, I still feel he's a great filmmaker and I just wish he'd go back to some of his more daring uh, uh, attempts to give us big time twists. So it looks like the happening just ain't happening. That's it for review. Check out all the reviews at TitanTV.com.